Hello everyone, this is uh, Arun here from Azure.com. In this video, I'm doing a review of uh, my mail newsletter plugin for WordPress blog. As you can see, I'm currently using on my WordPress blog uh, in sidebar. So this is the subscription box uh, which is generated by using this plugin itself. Okay, so let's get started with the review process. So in all campaigns, uh, here we are going to see the list of campaigns that we have recently sent to our subscribers. Right now, I don't have any campaigns, so you are seeing blank here and going to new campaign here we are going to design the newsletter which we need to send to our subscriber okay this is how the interface uh, looks like so this is the template which i am currently using we can easily add content like this okay if you want to edit uh, just uh, click on this small uh, small icon here and choose up choose the post that you want to insert just click insert here as you can see we have recent we just uh, inserted a latest blog post here okay if you want to edit image just click on this uh, edit icon and choose the image that you want to insert and click insert here okay so this is pretty easy to insert blog post to this newsletter we can use the drag and drop feature as well okay as you can see we are placing this content on above fold okay so this is how we can easily design newsletter and coming to this one delivery option in regular uh, in regular campaign we are going to actually send this newsletter right now itself okay if you want to set this newsletter as an auto responder you can choose this tab and choose these options and we can define auto responder options here okay so uh, we can also check uh, spam score here in the plugin area itself okay uh, click this button to test spam score of this uh, email uh, always uh, try to stay above seven okay with this one here we can choose the list that we want to send this newsletter to okay so if you want to choose background just uh, choose background here if you want to say change settings you can choose the settings here and coming to coming to auto responder we have currently two auto responders in this blog but uh, one is inactive and one is active so this uh, data will be available in the dashboard itself like uh, send open clicks and uh, subscribes everything will be available here itself okay so if you want to click if you want to see more stats click on the statistics okay it will show the stats about the newsletter or uh, it will show the stats about that uh, auto responder that you have sent as you can see one receiver one open all the data will be available here in the admin area okay total number of sent total clicks everything you can track in this plugin itself okay so where it has opened so this is the newsletter uh, which uh, set for auto responder as you can see number of clicks i am getting here this is the this is the place where users are getting clicks okay so we, we can see almost all data in this uh, with the help of this plugin like any professional uh, email marketing uh, service provider provides okay so list uh, here we can create uh, any number of list as you can see we have two lists now if you want to create new list you can create here and coming to subscribers here we can see the list of subscribers that we have okay if you want to view uh, detailed stats about that uh, subscriber click on edit option so this is how the stats looks like inside that subscriber window so as you can see uh, this uh, user has opened this email and uh, user has clicked this link on date timings everything will be tracked under this uh, you know using by with the help of this plugin the user has subscribed to two lists okay so if you want to unsubscribe you can unsubscribe here then moving to manage subscriber option here we will get a uh, import export and pending under uh, delete tabs so in import option here we are going to import a list of subscribers by using a csv files okay so in export we can export the lists we have collected like this this interface looks like in pending tab here we are going to see the list of number of subscribers which are currently pending okay means they have not yet clicked confirmation link okay if you want to delete any of your list just choose the links and choose this option okay you can easily delete any of our subscribers coming to template here uh, currently i'm having only a default template in my blog if you want to edit this template just click on edit html here we will get the source code just modify the source according to your needs okay so after modification click save button coming to settings newsletter here we are going to define the default uh, values that we need to use with this plugin okay for example like uh, from name uh, from address uh, we are going to define these things here so this is one time settings and we need to configure this after activating uh, this plugin 
okay i will show you that just i will show you the interface i'm not going to explain all those things here because it will take a lot of time so this is front end i don't think uh, this is um, subscribers if you want double opt in or no subscribers uh, forms here we are we can create any number of forms as you want okay just click on this button to create these things so this is where we are going to you know uh, custom css if you want to design your subscription form you can do that here okay so text so this is some sort of like this and uh, tags so this is the uh, tags we can use if you want to define your own tag you can define here okay delay our option right now i'm configured this uh, i configured this for a uh, mission issue you can use simple mail or smtp or gmail okay call and capabilities so here we are going to give the permissions which uh, user can do what functions okay this is how this interface looks like bouncing authentication so this is something no purchase code i highly recommend this plugin so if you have any doubts regarding this plugin just put it in comment below i will try to reply those comments thank for watching don't forget to like and comment here thank you bye